set up checkpoints all along the FDR freeway. I just tapped into their comms, and it sounds like Lockhart's down here overseeing the operation himself. He's got to be close, Prophet. Keep a low profile. <laughs> Find a way onto the FDR freeway. The order is to take him alive. The order is to bring him down. I'll argue the civil rights detail when we've done that. Alive is more useful. Yeah? Useful to who? The guy just got through massacring a couple dozen of my men, Miss Strickland. I'm taking no more chances. Prophet dies. Hargreave can have his corpse to play with. Hargreave wants... Hargreave the wants the suit. That's what he'll get. He isn't gonna like this. And last time I checked, we both That's worked for him. That's where you're wrong, Miss Strickland. You work for him. I answer to the cell executive board on the DOD. I don't give a shit what some senile old shareholder like Hargreave may or may not like! That's majority shareholder and former president of the Crynet board. You want to be careful what enemies you make here, Lockhart? This conversation is over! Tactical options available. What up all, Darp here from Minus Walkthroughs. Continuing Crisis 2, this is Chapter 4, Road Rage. See, I got it right this time. But, um, this is actually one of my favorite missions, just because I like the scenery. Kind of a cool place. And you got some cool stuff you get to do, and you end up driving a tank. So, all in all, it's a pretty kick-ass mission. Alright, now sometimes there'll be a guy up on this bridge here. Sometimes there won't. Um, if there is, then you can jump over on the left side. There's some, some like construction scaffolding or something. You can jump up on that and take them out silently, and then just keep walking up on the bridge. And know that if you do go uncloaked while on the bridge, they will see you. But that's okay. They can't really do anything about it. They can just bitch and moan, kind of like I do on a daily basis. You know. Now up here, I'm not entirely sure if this helicopter here, you'll see in just a minute. Yeah, that one. I'm not entirely sure if it will shoot you or what, but uh, I figure just expect it to shoot you and hide. Alright, so go ahead and stock up on ammo, grenades, whatever you need. Always stock up whenever you see these boxes, or at least double check that you, if you need to. Just because, you know, why not? Free ammo and grenades, I mean, what the hell. And this part's kind of cool. Um, that one guard will go walking out, thinking he knows where you are. Once he does, you're free to slip right past all of them. Now this is what I don't understand. They apparently know where you are. You got a guy tracking your position. But you can sneak past everyone. So I don't fully understand that. If someone wants to explain that in detail, please do. Because that just bugs the shit out of me right now. And then this group of guys really ain't so bad. Um, I think there's just one or two guys after you get past that first little wave. But all you gotta do is run and jump through, uh, or jump over the trailer. And then, I, I don't know why I was messing around with cloaking. There's no more guys. This is the end of the section. Oh shit! What is that? 